Are you a dropshipper? Do you want to become one? These five simple steps will make you dirty rich. Like. Well, not like me, because otherwise I wouldn't be making this video. All right, welcome to another video where we review Shopify apps. So this week we're looking at Printful, an on-demand Shopify uh, app that allows you to pursue the dropshipping method with your print store. Printful has a 4.6 review out of five. I was looking at my cheat sheet, but I really knew it. Uh, 2,500 reviews, if I recall correctly. And uh, it's completely free, so that's kind of the best part of it, but I guess... There is, but anyway, we'll see that. Uh, let's look at behind the scenes and look if you can build your dropshipping business on Printful. <laughs> the app is installed and integrated with our demo shop, and we are the account creation app. All right, let's fill this in real quick and click on sign up. Now we need to connect the store with our email. Let's click on the red button and we are on the app dashboard. The dashboard looks nice. It's clean and easy to navigate. We have a top navigation menu with a list of items, my printful products, orders, and warehouse. And if you click on this icon right here, you can find the account settings, the billing, statistics, affiliate, and help. All right. Let's click on the products here and we are on a new tab. On the products tab, we have a list of our current products and an option to add more products. So let's click on the red button that says add product and a new pop-up window appears. On the left, we have product filters and on the right, there is a product selection. Similar design as in AliExpress. Let's choose kits and youth clothing on the left and then all shirts. I must mention that the filtering sections you can choose from men's clothing, women's clothing, kits and youth clothing, hats, accessories, home and living and each of these items expands with a drop down menu all right back to the all shirts and the kits and youth clothing and here we can choose from i think 15 different shirts on this page you can see estimated product time variance sizing price and also in which countries it's available now we will click on the first one and we are on the design tab on this page you can find more details about the product choose which sizes and colors you want to sell and also choose where you want to place your design. You can pick front, back, right sleeve and left sleeve. We will choose front and click on upload file since we want to add our own design. But you can also add text and choose from the app's clip art. We are in the new pop-up window. We currently don't have any designs but as soon as we upload it, it will be shown in this field right here. Uh, no need to upload it every time you want to use it. Just click on it from this window. Now that our design is uploaded, just click on choose and we are back to the design tab. Here we can play with the size and position of our design. We will make a fit safe print area and we will proceed to the mockups. On the next page, we have to decide which mockup styles will be shown on our website. This is all okay, so we can click on proceed to descriptions. Five languages are available for the description. We will stick with English and change the product title just a little. Uh, maybe we'll write back to school t-shirt. Also, if you scroll down, you can change the description and the size guide measurement system. But let's jump to the pricing tab. Here you can change the price for each product size which is a nice feature. We will leave it as the same price for all sizes. The next step is to publish the product, but first let me choose a collection. Now we can click on submit to store button. We are back to the dashboard. Our product appeared and let's see how it looks in the store. Click on the view in Shopify and here it is. That's looking awesome. All right, let's go back to the actual dashboard to see what else we can do with the app. If you click on My Printful, you will get a lot of useful information, not only about Printful, but store marketing in general. Also, this is the tab where you will get help in case you need it. By the way, when we are speaking of help, you can also just reach to customer support via live chat right here in the right corner. When you get your first order, it will be shown in the Orders tab. Also, in the Orders tab, you can find the quick tutorial on how to place a manual. If you navigate to the file library, you can find all the designs and also upload your own. We saved the most special thing that Printful app is offering for the end. So wait for it is... Wait for it. Warehouse and fulfillment services, both for the US and the EU. Like, that's pretty bomb. I know Shopify just came out with that as well, but all you need to do with here is follow these simple four steps. First step is to click on add new product in the inventory tab to create and submit your product for our uh, approval. Once the products are approved, create a shipment that you will mail to Printful. When the products reach Printful and they're stocked, you'll see them in the inventory tab and then sync the products with your store. But like, that's pretty cool. This app is really so much more than just printing. Plenty of products are available. The analytics give you just enough details. Uh, warehousing and fulfillment services are pretty cool. And 
Also find the time to check out the amazing Printful lessons because they can really help you grow your actual store. So that's pretty cool. All right, that is it for today, people. I hope you enjoyed it. Please like, subscribe, leave a comment. Let me know what other apps you would like us to review. Maybe we forgot one. Maybe we're like, ah, oh, can you do a review of this or that? or like of this team in particular. For sure, we will jump on, do all the research, do a behind the scenes look so you don't have to install the app, mess up all your code, and then when you uninstall it, obviously your code doesn't get fixed, so it slows down your website, blah, 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 blah. <clears throat> so, um, if you need any dev work, my name is Andrew from ecomexpert.io, and I hope to see you in another video. Cheers! <laughs>